The United States contains over 3.5 million miles of rivers and streams, and over 41 million acres of lakes and reservoirs. Protecting our water is of extreme importance, especially since much of this water is what we drink every day. The Environmental Protection Agency, or EPA for short, has been working tirelessly for years to keep up the quality of our waterways. But we can't do it alone. That's right! We need your help in order to make a difference. And here's just a few ways you can join the effort. The EPA has determined that the most effective way to deal with our generation's water resource challenges is the watershed approach. The watershed approach basically focuses on tackling the pollution of our watersheds, or our closest rivers, streams, and bays, in order to help increase the cleanliness of our water on a national scale. Get involved on a local level. Find out where your local watershed is located and what groups help maintain its waters. See what each group does to help purify its watershed. Contact a few groups whose methods appeal to you and ask to join their cause. Joining causes is great. Getting actively involved is a whole new ballgame. Lake shorelines can be cluttered with trash. Get a few friends, and with the permission of your local park authority, help make your area clean by picking up junk bottle by bottle, can by can. Another way you can help is to increase awareness in your local community about the benefits of a clean watershed. This can involve speaking at community rallies, handing out flyers, and most effectively, contacting your state representatives and alerting them on the importance of passing legislation to help clean watersheds. But you don't even have to go out of your way very much to help out your local streams. Urban runoff is a major problem, where chemicals and trash are swept into storm surge drains. To help stop urban runoff, you can maintain your septic system, recycle used oil, dispose of household chemicals properly, don't overapply pesticides and fertilizers, use compost in your lawn and garden, conserve water and energy, plant vegetation buffers along streams, rivers, estuaries, and things like that. It's so simple. By following these tips, you can help contribute to the cleanliness and success of America's waterways. None of this would be possible without you. So please, get out there and help make a difference. Thanks for listening.